Now let's talk about ranges in Kotlin. Ranges lets you create a sequence of values to work with loops. Okay. So over here I have taken a few examples where I'm using ranges in different types. So the first one is where I'm using the double dot operator. Between 1 and 5 I'm using the double dot operator. That simply means it will print the values between 1 and 5 and the values will be 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. Okay. Later on you can also use less than or greater than signs as well to print the values less than or greater than the, the highest range in the number. Okay, over here it is one double dot operator and a less than sign from five. So the output will be one, two, three, and four. Okay. Similarly, you have another operator that is the down to operator. It simply gives you the uh, reverse of a particular range. Okay. It prints the values in a backward order. So over here I have taken five down to one. So it will simply print the values in a reverse order that is 5, 4, 3, 2 and 1. Okay. Next there is another operator that is the step operator. Okay. So you can use this step operator to create a gap between numbers. Okay. Between the uh, range. So it simply helps you to increment the values. And over here when I am taking 1 double dot operator 5 step 2. So it will simply print 1, 3 and 5 excluding each number in between. Okay. So one more thing to remember is that when I am taking step n then it is actually considering n minus 1 number of values to exclude. Okay. You can also use uh, these operators with characters as well. Over here I have taken an example where I am trying to print the characters between a and h. So and I am also using the less than uh, sign over here that will only print till G okay and it will exclude H so the values will be A, B, C, D, E, F and G and if you in case try to use the step operator over here it will also give you the values like let's try to run it once step 2 let's suppose I'm taking it as 2 so after execution it will give a values that is A, C, E and G okay so you can use it with the characters as well.